The nation launched an AI strategy committee today with the growing need to build infrastructure and rules for the emerging technology. Now, with that, President Yi Jinping called AI key to the nation's survival. Correspondent Yoon Jung-min reports. Cutting-edge technology such as AI amounts to national power. That was President Yi Jae-myung as he spoke at the launching ceremony of the National AI Strategy Committee in Seoul with the aim of transforming the country into one of the top three global AI powerhouses. President Yi noted that the nation stands at an inflection point that will determine whether it becomes a pioneer, enjoying opportunities, or a follower lagging behind. He set forth directions where the nation's AI strategy is headed, raising AI accessibility, encouraging private sector engagement, overhauling AI-friendly rules and negative regulations, and seeking balanced regional growth along the way. The AI Strategy Committee was launched on Monday as the nation's AI policy control tower, with the president assuming the role of its chair. Under eight subcommittees, more than 30 members from the private sector joined the body, along with over a dozen minister-level officials. During the initial meeting, an AI action plan was reported, centered on creating an ecosystem for AI innovation, seeking transition to AI on a national level, and taking the lead on the global stage, details of which will be unveiled in November. Among things on the agenda was creating an AI highway, for which a national computing center will be established, involving private investment while securing an additional 15,000 GPUs by 2028. Also discussed were ways to promote the industry beyond borders, with ideas pitched by committee members. President Yi responded that if Korea's AI is supplied to the third world through ODA projects, it will be a win-win for both, and such a change will help the industry make inroads into the global market. On top of that, the committee discussed directions for an AI law, which is set to be formulated soon before taking effect in January, with the focus on an AI convergence complex. Yoon Jung-min, Arirang News.